In a previous lesson, you learned if you want to swing some part to some part, you need to one segment and define the segment. For example, uh, I have a simple polygon here <clears throat> that you can define it uh, to swing to the this part. If you go into the swing, as you can see, it is one segment defined and you can uh, swing to, to each other. If you want to swing the segment in half or here you can change and add a point. For example, you can add a point here. As you can see, if you add a point and go to the edit point, it mm, breaks to the two segments. But it sometimes uh, we don't want this and change the topology and the polygon and here we can use the notch tool if you select a notch and here it's exactly like the <clears throat> at a point if you want to <clears throat> go with exact position before clicking right click it's exactly like before in a at a point you can split into the two line with a ratio split by your length or unify split in two, three, or any segment that you want. If you okay, as you can see, add a notch there. What's the difference between notch and add a point? If you go to the edit pattern, as you can see, if you click, it's the one unique segment and it does not make it to the part. But what is the benefit? The swimming tool define the notch tool. As you can see, we didn't break the line the segments but the swimming tool is defining the notch tool but if you go into the edit point it's just one so this is most benefit of the notch tool for deleting that you can go and select a notch tool here and here you can change the type i shape v shape as you can see <clears throat> you can go with perpendicular or with angle that you want a box shape box shape and you can flip it or you can lock it okay uh, here you can lock the position uh, from the start okay uh, it's better I give an example with a simple thing here the notch tool I selected for example exactly here and I have a notch selected and uh, box shape and here you can lock it you can uh, lock this distance it means you can change your points but this distance will be maintained as you can see this distance from here will be maintained or you can go to notch tool select it from the end as you can see in this time this tool will be locked and you can change this segment okay it's locked it's locked it's distance between notch tool and the point you can change it at the start or the end for selecting that, you can go into the notch tool and use the lock if you want it. Hello, my friends. To continue these tutorials on YouTube, subscribe us, like us, and hit the bell icon. And now you will be alerted about all of the amazing videos that we release.